Hey guys, alright, so you guys are probably wondering what the hell wig do you have on? Where did you get this weave? No, this is my hair and it's a hot ass mess so if you did think it was a wig you should be ashamed of yourself. But yeah, for you guys that have seen my previous videos and everything like that, you've seen my hair before, especially in my How to Lay Your Wig video. There I showed you guys what technique I used to lay my wig. Um, but since, I believe, last, this time last week, I cut all my hair off because I just, it was a hot mess. I just can't. It got really, really long within the last three to four months, but it was, my hair grows very unevenly. So it grows really long on both sides and the middle will be like either at a standstill or a crawl. So the middle I would say was probably right here while the ends were somewhere down here, which I, mm -mm, that's so tacky, and a lot of people are going to get mad for this, this comment that I'm going to make, but a lot of black girls and some black boys out there, they try to hold on to length so hard that they'll walk around with these straggly ass ends and just it looks a mess it looks a mess like if those little raggedy ends are what's giving you the length it let it go let it go just cut it to a healthy length where i cut mine way shorter than i should have way shorter than the healthy length that i could have but it's my hair can grow back really quick so it's not a big deal for me and you see how short it is it's literally it doesn't come past my shoulders and this I haven't had hair this short in over 10 years other than a wig <laughs> but yeah it's cute I guess it's like it's really easy for me because literally all I have to do is wash my hair or wet it while I'm in the shower throw in some leave-in conditioner and call it a day I don't have to do much and I haven't worn a weave or a wig or anything like that because I'm just, you know, messing around with my hair. But, oh, believe, this will be braided up in a beehive real soon and calling it a day, throwing back my wigs on and getting this hair popping. Now, I think that my hair is so short, I'm going to start wearing longer weaves, which sounds so stupid and weird, but now I feel like I need to start wearing longer hair, which anybody that knows me knows I'm all for a 14 inch. I'm all for a 16 inch, but once you do 18 and 20, 22, 24, 26, even 28s and 30s, I, I'm not here for that. That I don't want to be able to put my head in a car and... My hair is stuck in the door. That, mm -mm, that's a pet peeve of mine. And when I used to wear a long weave or when even my hair was too long and my hair gets stuck in the door, it's the worst thing in the world. Like, it literally pisses me off. So, now that I'm bald-headed, I don't really have to worry about that anymore. <laughs> it's way thicker. It's just looks so much better. Oh, my God. It's just like, hmm. It looks like raggedy hot mess right now, but compared to the picture that I'm going to show you guys, which should be right here, before I cut it, it was a mess. Like, and my friend Star, who, cuts my, who cut my hair and who, like, does my braids sometimes, she was like, I'm not cutting it that short. Like, I literally had to make her cut it. And she was like, oh, I'm going to put it, I'm going to braid it so that you can keep the braid. So I was like, oh, I can just do it and show it in my YouTube video. This is how much hair I cut off like you can see like right here where it was starting to get way too like too thin like mm -mm, that ain't cute so just consider where my hair would have been this is the front and this is because my hair is curly it would be like right here and you I can't even get it all in the video standing on my tippy tippy toes but yeah it was almost 
to like the top of my butt almost. A little bit shorter than that. But yeah, it's gone. What can you do? Nothing now, but wait for it to grow. And I normally don't have a problem with my hair growing, but of course, now that I cut it this short, I probably will. But it is what it is. I like it for right now, for maybe the next few days, but you already know, I'll braid it up anyway. But yeah, I wanted to come and make a video for you guys because I got a lot of questions. I got a whole lot of DMs, like messages on Facebook, why did you cut your hair, what's going on, are you okay, and I'm fine, I'm living. I cut it because my hair does not define me, um, and if I want it to define me and be extra long, I can put on a wig. So, yeah. And nine times out of ten, no one even knows I have on a wig. So, yeah. But, that's it. That's really it. My curl pattern has improved a great deal since I've cut it. It's way curlier. The ends were just like straggly and straight. And one thing that I did notice is because I haven't dyed my hair in a long time. My hair is so many different colors right now. It's literally like maybe right here. The ends are a 1B. The top is my natural hair color. And it's like transforming into this brownish red. It's like a number two four situation right here right here is like a number six or eight it's weird my hair is like this really awful hair color which is why i don't do a leave out anymore because i don't dye my hair so yeah it is it's like what can i do about it now <sighs> that's it guys that's all i wanted to do make this video so i stopped getting a thousand questions yeah, that's it. Ball-headed, and it is what it is. Bye, guys.